I've been looking after Castle Trinity for seven years now. I come here most days and I've never got bored of it. I meet and greet our guests, we give them honey from our bees, eggs from our chickens, and we always make sure the fire is well stocked so the house is always warm and cosy. And it's a very unusual place because it's set in this wild northern landscape, but yet it's got the glitz and the glamour which Terry and Michael bring to the place. So I grew up in Leeds in a rough council estate, um, never imagining that I'm going to live in a castle. From the age of 17, I started out DJing in the northern club scene and then went on to owning our own bars and clubs. And this place has been a total contrast to the crazy nightlife that we've been involved in. Because of the privacy and luxury, we've been very fortunate to host some great guests here, some very exclusive people. People often ask us how long it's taken to do the place up, but it's, it's an ongoing project. It's taken forever, to be honest. Michael's been in his element. Obviously, it's a 19th century castle, and we've got to be sympathetic to that. But you've got to remember that we've come from a lifestyle of entertainment and nightclubs and, and that kind of industry. So when it comes to design, Michael loves to be a little bit out there, doing things slightly different as well as keeping it opulent. It has been really good fun to work on something like this amazing building. Uh, you know, I'm a nightclub designer at heart, so, so the mixture of keeping the, the rawness of the, the, the structure of the building to then putting bits from nightclubs in to bring that fun factor in, and I think with the warm fabrics, it's worked really well. So one thing we have done is we've turned the old stable block for the Shire horses into a lovely warm, all year round swimming pool an outside hot tub, which people just absolutely love. Some of the best times at the castle have been sat around the fire, playing board games, just looking out the window at the wildlife. The scenery just changes throughout the seasons. You know, having guests come round and, and making a nice meal is probably one of my favourite things that I ever do here. Even trying to rack out a tune on the piano, although Michael never approves when I do that. We try and treat all our guests like they're our friends. The leave like they've known us for years. 